you know, customize your character like we've had before. Um, it's even better now. And uh, let's okay. go a little bit. <laughs> you get to take your ID badge. We, we've added this uh, photo mode in the game that's really, really cool. The photo mode allows you to change your field of view, zoom in, zoom out, and you'll see all the filters that are coming up. You can do this both here when you take your badge. It's like a training tutorial for it. And then you can do it anytime you want out in the wild with your friends, with dead enemies, with live enemies. Um, we have also added this to our load screen system. There's not a lot of loads in our game, but when you fast travel, there's a little one. And so any of the pictures you've taken there will pop up like a random deck with, along with our curated photos. Um, we, we really, this is came out of a game jam. We do these game jams in the middle of projects to see what new features we want to try to add in. And this was one of our favorite ones. Yeah, it turned out, it turned out really, really great. Um, and, and fun for socially shareable stuff too, even exactly. offline. You, you share, could, you could with your friends. Um, and so, you know, again, make your character, there's a whole host of it. You can take pictures where you want. You can also, anytime in the game, change how your character looks. Because you, you know, you're going to play a character for a long time and you can... You so you get your, if you hit level two when you step out, you kind of complete the initial vault thing. And the first thing you do when you level up is pick a special that you want to increase. Um, if you played previous fallouts, we have all the seven specials. And after you pick the one you want to increase, you then pick a perk in that special. So here we're choosing Gladiator, uh, which is a melee perk. And then that is a card. As you can see, the, the perk system, are, the perks are cards. And then you equip those, and every special is a pool of points for the cards you want to equip. And each card has, you know, I don't want to say mana cost, but a point cost right. for how powerful that card is. And do you have the right special for equipping it? Right. And is it flexible, or, or, or am I jumping it? Much further along, picking charisma. We can talk about charisma is interesting. Yeah. Um, Here's a perk that lets mutations act better with groups. Um, and so you can pick any perk that you meet the requirements for when you level up. There's no randomness there. And here's what it looks like with a character that's further along. We've upped the cap for each special to 15 mm -hmm. from 10. That allows a, you know better balance for which cards you're equipping. And the cards right now go from one point up to five points in power. And then as you level up, more cards become available. I've got a bunch of questions okay, about that, but I will there and nope, talk, nope. chat a little bit. Keep okay. But uh, I wanted to ask about charisma. Should I ask that later? About uh, We can talk about that now, yeah. Yeah, Chris, how does charisma work in an online game? If, if we're not talking about NPCs that you can influence, what, what, is, what does charisma do for you? Uh, Um, we do have gold. That one's great. Um, we have gold cards that animate. Of course, you get a joke and a stick of gum. Nice. And um, <laughs> the gum, actually, for fun, is a very slight. It reduces your hunger for a while if you chew the gum. Nice. Um, and so they're a, they're. A